Sinplane 2 has been officially announced. It should be released by quarter three, 2023. Magnus from Sonic Charge has released a video going over some of the features and demoing uh, the synth so you can check it out. Instantly, you can kind of see a different graphic design and the UI looks really good. So first feature that's being showed off is Geno Patch. This is the artificial intelligence aspect that's been added to Sinplant. I mean, already Sinplant's strongest suit is the fact that you can just explore sound without getting too caught up in the uh, workflow that most synthesizers force you into. So it's just more exploration. Whenever I use Sinplant, I just load a bunch of random sounds and keep doing that. So if I have a general idea of what I want and I can throw it into this AI, I feel like this is just gonna be an even faster way to get sounds that I want. Also, again, I love the UI. And I'm not sure what some of these other buttons are down here, like the little ear or the tuning fork. On the website, it does say that there's some features that haven't been announced yet. So there's still some hype being built up around that, I guess. Look at the DNA sequence. It looks like editing the DNA is gonna be a lot easier. And then down here, you get the little uh, footnotes. It's just, it seems a lot more approachable now. Branch thing, really good feature. This is really fun. This is kind of a thing you could do in Simplant 1. It's actually a sound I was experimenting with recently. So being able to layer them up and have sort of asynchronistic LFO patterns is a really big plus. And you know what? Glide isn't even one that I thought about until I saw it in this demo. Yeah, there's just some features that Simplant 1 did not have that everyone wanted. For example, macros you can now macro or automate things like the filter cutoff or whatever um, automation was not in sin plan one so having it in two that's probably one of the biggest features people were looking for um and glide is just another one i wasn't thinking about or legato it seems like there's a couple more options <laughs> Right now, Sinplant costs $100, and then whatever Sinplant's two official price ends up being, if you own Sinplant 1, all you have to do is pay the difference for the upgrade. Thank you so much for watching.